Do you know what this is? Are you sure? This is a pulmonary infarct. Let's see if you can get the practice question right. 60 year old man presents with acute shortness of breath and pleuritic chest pain. When histologic finding, oh, which histologic finding is most consistent with the infarct? It's gonna be a red wedge-shaped infarction with coagulative necrosis. So you'd be excused from thinking that the lungs can't infarct, right? Because they get blood from both the pulmonary and the bronchial, bronchial arteries. But if a large embolus hits fast and hard, it'll just overwhelm the system. So yes, you can, and you'll get a wedge-shaped red infarct, usually in the lower lobe, pointing to the hilum. Why red? Why is it red? Well, that's because of the hemorrhage from the collateral bronchial flow. And so you get sudden dyspnea, pleuritic pain, hemoptysis, it's ischemia. And so dual blood supply doesn't always mean immunity. Pale infarct, that's typical of your heart, kidney, and spleen. That's your pale-shaped necrosis. This is going to hit hard and fast. So it's going to be a red wedge-shaped infarct with coagulative necrosis. Liquefactive if it's in the brain. Central caseous necrosis. That's your tuberculosis. Alveolar spaces filled with neutrophils and fibrin. That's your alveolar exudates. So that's seen in pneumonia. Like and subscribe to Past Step 1.